huge losses for two huge movies that were supposed to make the bank. Uh, Bloodshot, uh, made for $45 million, only made $29 million at the box office because they had to pull it or they couldn't show it because that is closed all over the world. Uh, so there's a huge loss. They only made $10 million in the U.S. Um, and so the movie is basically going to have to go to streaming or they have to come back in a couple of months and show it again, try to make their money back. Uh, at $29 million, that's a loss. That's a huge loss. Uh, you could say that's about $15 million, maybe about $5 million in advertising, and they've lost $10 million, even without anything. They've just lost $10 million, just think. So they're going to make that scratch back, and it's going to be tough. But hey, um, I'm sure people will come back to the theaters when they're able to, when it's safe to. Uh, the other movie, uh, and that of course, you know, is starring um, Vin Diesel, myself, and um, Rico. We were going to go together and watch it uh, with some friends if possible. But now, of course, we're going to have to wait for a couple of months down the road when they re show it. Hopefully, they will re show it. Um, and of course, that's based on the uh, Valent Comics book. Underwater, uh, a movie starring uh, Kristen Stewart, made for 80 million only made 40 million so unlike um, bloodshot which made 39 uh, 29 compared to 45 uh, million uh, for what it was made for uh, for 29 million return the, uh, underwater lost 40 million or only made 40 million so there's 40 million dollar loss so they're getting hit hard uh, and like they said I think they said there was like about um, 40 million 40 something like that 20 billion dollar loss in the first week of um the veerberg hitting so you've got uh staying with the movie news um they're saying that they're going to put um delay all the big movies like um 1984 wonder woman uh War, um mulan for disney of course and as well as um uh, Black Widow, because they, if this is the, if this is a format of the losses, if they, you know, if they go to streaming, they will never be able to recover that much money, unless they do pay per view, which nobody's going to want to pay for twenty bucks and not uh, see it on a big screen. They might, you know, they will go well. I've got five kids, you know, divide that by twenty bucks, twenty five bucks, or forty bucks. It might work out, but really money's tight right now for families all over the world because of the lockdown so they're probably going to go you know what we're not even going to bother watching uh, paying pay-per-view for uh, Wonder Woman 94 or for um, Black Widow or for Milan we'll just wait it wait for it a couple months down the road all the movies that are in production like the Batman isn't going to happen this year They'll probably come back, maybe at the end of the year, they go back into production, because they're all shut down, all production shut down. So they could probably come back into um, production later on in the year and release in 2021. So that's me for today, guys. Um, 